It's a bumpy year for animal arrivals at the park, and each one brings huge excitement for the keepers. And for emu-obsessed Gemma at the family farmyard, it's a big day. This is Biscuit. Uh, he's a very, very handsome emu. And we also have Banty and Buttons in here as well. And a new girl is joining the set. Just behind this door is our brand new emu. Um, she's called Bourbon and she's very, very pretty. Gemma's already in love. She's absolutely amazing. I mean, she's to die for. She's, she's really friendly, very loving. And I'm just, I'm super excited to have her here. What Bourbon doesn't know is that today she'll meet the rest of the gang. But a smooth introduction isn't guaranteed. Emus, they're quite dangerous animals. Um, so mixing, mixing these birds together, they could potentially hurt each other. Gemma and her team will mix the birds in a small space so they can keep an eagle eye on them all. I've got such a bond with, with all of them. So it's, it's quite intense because you don't know what's going to happen. And, you know, I don't want any of them to get hurt. But being wild birds, the resident two boys and a girl won't welcome the new recruit into their gang without an initiation. If you guys are okay, just to stand right back, just in case. Um, as I said, they are quite dangerous birds. I'm hoping it's going to go well. Obviously, there will be a lot of vocalisation between them and um, possibly some pecking as well. As expected, these naturally powerful and assertive birds get in the way of Bourbon's dash for it. This is normal for, for mixing. Um, it, it's like a dominant thing, you know, that's both the boys at the moment and that is another female. Bourbon's holding her ground and isn't giving in to intimidation. Easy, easy. The other collection that we bought her from said that she was quite a dominant female, so uh, girl power and all that. She can definitely take care of herself, that's for sure. Though it looks aggressive, this emu dance is a common ritual that means the mix is going positively. We also call it the feather boa because they just, poof, they, you know, their necks just go all awesome and fluffy. Um, and that's just another reason why I love them so much. But this isn't about Gemma's love life. With an established couple already in the bag, this brassy bird's been brought in for the eligible bachelor. This is Bounty, and Bounty's a bit of a third wheel at the moment because biscuit and buttons are an item. So we were hoping that Bourbon would uh, pair up with Bounty. So that's the tough introduction over with. But things could get vicious for Bourbon in the great wide field without Gemma and the gang to help. Good, good girl, yay! This bit is the hardest bit of all um, because now that they're out, there's not really much we can do. It's just scary because there's, we can't physically do anything. You know, I mean, we could we could go in the field, but they're much faster than we are. You know, they they go at like 30 miles an hour. It's nice to see her running around. Um, yeah, she just needs to find her feet. It's chaos as we're talking. It's what emus do. They, they, they speed up and down the fields and they... Watch your back. It's like a bullet. In the wild, they, they'd be bombing it around everywhere. So seeing all four of them just trotting along together in a line was just amazing. Success! Do the emu dance. <laughs>